and welcome back to another episode of Project Arai. And this is it. This is the last episode, everyone. We're, f we're finally here. We're finally at the very end. There'll be no more nuclear power plants after this. No more. It's all gone. All gone. That that's it. We're, we're done now. <laughs> but back, back to rice fields, I guess. <laughs> uh, no, I kid, I kid. No, but there probably will be some rice fields. I'm not going to lie. I, I need to scratch that itch again. Anyways, I was looking the other day and I was actually quite shocked to see that this has taken us six episodes to build. Way more than I thought I was going to do. I thought this was maybe going to be like part two, part three, and then we're finally done. And no, we, we've gone all the way to part six. If I knew it was going to be part six, I'd probably just have carried on the episodes. I think part one and two is is decent. I think... When you go past that, you're kind of stretching it a little bit. So, yeah, I've kind of stretched it a little bit to part six. <laughs> but, yeah, I was um, I was very shocked it's um, taken that many episodes to build. But there's... Looking at them um, and looking at it in-game, we've actually built a lot. It's pretty much the size of Nunoshida, which, <laughs> when I was looking, I was... I couldn't believe it. Like, if I copy and paste it over the top, it's literally bigger. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, I can understand why it's taken so many episodes, but... Um, I don't mind. It's turned out looking great. W way better than I thought it was going to turn out, to be quite honest. Because I've never built a nuclear power plant, and I was, I was low-key dreading it quite a little bit. Um, so, yeah, <laughs> I was not looking forward to it. But I've got no complaints. It's turned out great. I've actually learned a few things even while building it, so that's even better, I suppose. Now, in a few days, I am going to be releasing another episode. It's not going to be building related on me talking or anything. It's just going to be pure cinematics of the nuclear power plant. Mainly just because I'm quite impressed with it and... I feel like a cinematic episode just showing it off as a whole, I think would be pretty cool. So yeah, there's that to look forward to in a few days after this one airs. Not sure when that's going to be. Um, I've kind of been slacking lately a little bit. Now, that all being said, there's going to be a tiny bit of a break, maybe after this episode, of maybe a week or two at most. And this is purely because I'm not sure what I want to build next or where I want to build next. Because I've been building this nuclear power plant for so long, I haven't thought about anything but the nuclear power plant, to be quite honest. So, yeah, it's been on my mind a lot. And I'm not sure what I want to want to do next. Um, I've got a few ideas, don't get me wrong, but... There's a few other things I want to sort out. Um, I've noticed that my RAM usage is getting quite high. And it's my own fault because I see stuff on the workshop and instead of just favoriting it and then looking at it later and then deciding if I like it or not and then unfavoriting it if I don't like it, um, what I've been doing is just subscribing to them. <laughs> so I've got a stockpile of skyscrapers, factories, warehouses, more houses, commercial buildings, a lot of other props and stuff for when we might get to a city, maybe. And it's really starting to eat my RAM. It's making my game loading slower. And I don't want to hit the problem that I've hit in the past. And in the past, when I've built stuff, this was when I had, like, 32 gigs of RAM. I would hit a problem where after I'd built so much and I'd downloaded so much, because I'll be honest, you kind of need 64 gigs plus if you want to really go heavily modded and kind of build in this style of way. Because you pretty much replace everything that's vanilla in the game, pretty much. And it it takes a lot on the 
on the RAM. And any, anyways, I'm starting to ramble. Um, yeah, anyways, in the past, the problem I get is I'll have so much, done so much, blah, 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 blah. And my game will start to almost lag in game to where I'll be moving my camera around or I'll be selecting a building to put down. And my game will just freeze for like one or two seconds. But then obviously because it's frozen while I was trying to move or try to do something, my camera will be halfway across my screen, like somewhere else. And I don't want to get to that state because I've tried playing and building in that state where it was literally lagging every few seconds and it, it's just unplayable to be to be honest and with how much we've built in the game so far and what i want to build in the future i just kind of want to safeguard myself from wasting my ram on stuff that i'm not using and then lagging game and then get really frustrated by it and then probably just stop building altogether. So I wouldn't I wouldn't just safeguard myself from that first of all. So I'm just going to go through it all, look through all the mods. I've I've literally last time I looked on my subscribed uh, mods um with 30 on a page. I believe I've got seven pages of stuff that I've downloaded but I haven't used yet. It's just skyscrapers like I said. Uh, factories, buildings, houses, um, props, and so on. Um, so I, I have that to go and look through as well. So that can be kind of tedious um, going through it. Plus, um, it's getting to that time of the year, isn't it? So there's always that as well, um, taking away time. So yeah, maybe one to two weeks. Um, and on top of that, we also have... I don't know where to build. I really don't. Um, and I'm kind of thinking, because it's getting to that time of the year, maybe it would be cool if we did the hot springs in the mountain, um, where I was talking about it being kind of snowy up there. But I'm just not sure how I'm going to go about building up there, because... I'd have to have a look, um, but I don't know if I'm I'm stretching the limits um, right now. But I kind of want some trees in the snowy area that, that look like they have snow on. But obviously, the theme and everything and the stuff in the game isn't set to the, the winter. I think it was an expansion. Um, I'm not quite sure. Um, but I don't know how I'm going to be able to get the trees to kind of look like they've got snow on them. So I do have that bridge to cross. <laughs> um, so yeah, I've got that to think of. But I also want, before I even build the hot springs at the top of the mountain, I want to build the town below it. It's not going to be a massive town or anything. It's just going to be like a little small one. Maybe like 30, 40 people live there, if that. Um, so yeah, I, I, I still don't know. I'm still going to have to brainstorm. I, I might even decide not to even bother. Um, I might do something else, but I'm thinking, you know, with it getting to that time of year, maybe it would be cool to do something like that. But I don't know. I, I'm, I'm really stuck on what to do at the moment. And I also got a recommendation from a friend of mine, but I want to... I want to build the city or at least get the layout kind of of the city before I build it. And he recommended building a military base, which I thought would be really cool. And I do have a lot of favorited mods for like jets, tanks, APCs, armored personnel carriers and all that lovely jazz. And I think it'd look pretty cool, but I want to get like the layout of where the city is going first. Because we've got so much that we still need to build. We still need to finish Nonashida off. Do the hot springs in the mountains with the town below it. And then there's a third village I want to build um, to the far right of Nonashida near the highway. And I just want to get it all 
kind of gridded out first. So I think maybe after that other stuff's been done, maybe I'll kind of decide, oh yeah, and there was an airport as well I was tinkering with the idea of. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the airport. Uh, I've never built an airport before, so that's going to be quite difficult. But that is on the agenda to eventually build. Um, yeah, anyways, I'm just starting to ramble, to be um, to be honest. Um, I haven't even talked about the episode or anything. Um, yeah, so it's the last episode. So I think I'm just going to leave you with that, because I've got a lot to think about. Um, so yeah, I hope you really enjoy this episode. Um, it's been really cool building this, and I think it's cool that you've stuck around to enjoy it, and you all comment and do all that lovely jazz. So yeah, I hope you enjoy the rest of the episode, and like always, I'll see you all in the next one.